Is it live? Come on. You can do it, YouTube. Hey, there we go. So I've been talking to myself for like two minutes. Uh, I, I, I'm changing too much stuff in, in how I do streaming stuff. But we're all good now. We're, we're, we're in real, we're back in the real world. So let me just say for um, people watching the VOD, um, let me know in the comments if there's good moments to call out um, for timestamps or if there's something good for a highlight reel or, you know, whatever. Um, that can really help both people watching the video and me if I'm going to make a highlight reel or, you know, mark it in the video. And if you give a super chat, I will give, um, I now do a little, a little timestamp and a little shout out in the, the description. So it's a good way to make your mark on a video. Hey there, Nyao. I, I said hi to you, but you couldn't hear because I <laughs> didn't press the go live button yet. And I completed. So, today we're going to play home. And just as a quick note, the game starts with a little um, content warning of um, drug use and suicide and general dark themes. Same, similar to off, I suppose. Hang on, I'm going to turn the heat down. I don't know what it is, but just... I feel hot when streaming. Like, I, I have to, like, turn down the heat a little bit. I just get... I guess it's nerves or something. But yeah, this is an off fan game made by um, Felix the Judge. Rest in peace. We lost Felix a while ago. But, uh, hey, a good game is still a good game, and we're going to play it. This is, in fact, the Memorial Edition. This is a special version um, with some fairly minor tweaks, I believe, from um, from Tiny Ghosty, who made one. In fact, let me show you a couple things from one real quick. Um, I think it's um, High Parky. I don't know exactly what all the changes are. I think it's mostly like, you know, minor correction spelling issues. She said it wasn't very, like, very much. Um, let me just show you some quick peeks at one. This is the new version of one. That this is another off fan game that we play. That uh, I played version four. This is version five. Basically, this is in development, not out yet. Oh come on, look at it. Looks so good. Um, it looks a lot better than the version I played was good, but there's a lot of um, There's just so much polish in the new version But we're not playing one today. We're playing home That's right Parker Mew. Okay. Let me... Oh, that's is that the wrong button? Oh, there, there we go. Okay. Testing. This font is hard to read. <laughs> everyone, everyone is super nervous about that thanks to uh, the original off release having font issues. But yep, we can read it this time. Oh, chat, you're a little, uh, you're a little on the small side. Let me fix that. There you go. No offense, chat, but there you go. That looks a bit better. In the end, so we watched, we streamed off last week. So I don't know if this is the sequel or prequel. I was always like, how do you even do an off fan game? Because at the end of off, you know, hmm. but we'll see in the end. Little bones on the, oh, there he is. Uh, 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 pixel filter. In the beginning. So we got a prequel. Oh, enter our name. I'll, I'm going to be boring. I won't be Frank Tide Pod today. I'm just going to be good old Tap Tap. Just good old regular human Tap Tap. Named over seven characters. Now. Long may have issues. Nah, we're fine. Are you, are you good with puzzles? That's a good question to ask. I'm going to lie and say yes. Would you go as far as to say you're an expert on puzzles? No, no thanks. Are you good at handling combat situations? Okay, it lets you it ha lets you choose your difficulty. I always love that. Um, some of the Silent Hill games let you choose puzzle difficulty separately from combat difficulty. Expert in the fields of battle. I'm gonna go on normal difficulty, I suppose. Welcome, Tap Tap. You've been assigned to being called the Judge. Kitty. Your job is to watch over the Judge. There's an important figure. He is a guide, but also a guardian. He's the guardian of Zone Zero. The world has changed. Your role, however, has not. Your game begins here. So, I think I've heard some of the music from this game, and it's good because it was used as kind of a placeholder in one. I think it's all original music in the final version. 
which we might stream one again once it's all 100% complete. I always like the, these more artistic interpretations of the original pixel art of like, you know, the, the world's very bleak and like liney, not, like not linear, but like just straight crude lines. Greetings, tapped up. Here's our precious little judge still asleep. Yeah, he is. There's that boy. My quest to continue. We should probably wake him up. Hey, hey, don't don't, don't sleep in the middle of the room. Oh, you're oh, you're in a room, but still. Do not interact with objects in the environment. Press the enter key in this instance to wake up our guardian. Do we have to wake him up though? I'm using it. So you shouldn't. Oh wait, I should turn off my. I don't. I don't like the noise suppression filter. It works well, but it. Ugh. It adds a just slightly weird quality to my voice that I don't like. I'm using, um, you should barely be able to hear. I'm using this USB SNES style thingy. Come on. Wake up. Wake up. Okay, I think this game, I think it uses buttons that are not, in fact, on. Uh-oh. Perfect, he's now awake. Okay, maybe I can't use the gamepad. He's now awake. Who is the one beyond my eye? Wait, what, what, what voice did I do for him? He was like incredibly British. I think this might be based on an earlier translation, in fact. Um, so he may not be as extremely British. I think this is more based on the original Reconstructed Dragon translation, which is what I played um, back in like 2012. Yeah, the music's all original stuff by a few different people, including Alias. Oh, really? There's some original Alias stuff in there? Oh, great. Hey, Earl. And Amir. And Maro. So I'm a little behind on chat with all the reading. Who's the one behind my eye that dares to speak to me in such a tone? No need to be alarmed, Judge. You knew this day would come. Known since the beginning. Today is the day of your role as a puppet. It's your turn to become a marionette for the new world. Tap Tap is your puppeteer. Hell yeah. <laughs> Welcome, Tap Tap. I've been waiting for you to, some time for your arrival. Yeah, he's not as British this time. That's gonna throw me off. To move more around, use the arrow keys. Press left to test this movement. Perfect. On your way to your next lesson, view the database of your new puppet escape key. Object. Competence. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> no competence. That's me. Tiny claws. Look at the tiny little claws. My status. Judge. Class judge. Title guardian. Tiny claws. Oh, I got different things now. I was always weird. Defense one, defense two, defense three. But now we got coat, collar, coat, and sound. It's special, which are probably days of the week. Hey, Jake. Row. Oh, this is a non-functional row. <laughs> Can't command. Good. You learned fast. We shall speak again, Tat Tat. For now, you will be left alone. By the way, I want to point out this game defaults to start in um, full screen mode, which A, screws up a bunch of stuff on my screen. And just it's, so, it's just an old, old version of RPG Maker. 2003, I believe. Um, and on a, it's uh, on a 32 by 9 wide monitor, and it's a 4-3 game, so it's stretched like 10 times wider than it should be almost. Uh, it doesn't look too good, but hey, you getting, I windowed it. Tap tap, it appears someone has just arrived. Please guide me to the stairs placed before me. Our jury begins now. Okay. You imbecile. <laughs> now is not the time to be wasting our breath pawing at pointless stones. Let's move on. Aw. Oh. Whatever, Judge. So I don't... I don't seem to have the enter key on my gamepad, but I don't think it matters. Were my eyes this red before? I don't remember my eyes being quite this red. Is it the Batterman? Uh-oh. 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 Bad things. Bad things. So a mysterious figure decided to place himself before me. Such a creature to invade my precious personal zone. He does have a little bit of the fancy talk, but he's not like... Like, in intensely passionately british like he is in um future game passionately british can you, can you even be passionately british as being like passionately dispassionate right i'm gonna get a letter from the queen of england she's gonna be like god damn it tap tap what the hell shut up <laughs> shut up about my country you fuck that's how the queen talks right tap tap you talk about me bitch again oh now that's what the queen sounds like. Alright. So a mysterious figure had decided to place himself before me. Such a creature to invade my precious personal personal zone. 
I don't quite understand the game, missed all of your recent streams. Oh, this this is a fan game based of off, and I'm not sure I could describe it. Basically, um, I don't know. I haven't played this game before either, so I don't know if we're just going to be the judge in the game. Nevertheless, I'll introduce myself. I'm the judge. I'm aching to know your name, dear capped man. There he is! There's that ducky! I'm the batter. I've been assigned to a sacred mission. It has come to my attention. You're in need of your help. He looks like such a psychopath just dragging the bat around. That's just such a nice little detail that makes someone seem like they're fucking deranged. Sacred mission. If your mission is so sacred, then why are you in need of my help? Mom says it's my turn on the Xbox. That is exactly what that pose says to me, yes. The world beyond this... Ooh. Not quite a perfect loop there, but Off had that same issue. <laughs> In fact, this may be a track by Alias, I don't know. The world beyond this zone is corrupt. I must purify it. However, I've noticed a spirit around you. Shall I purify said spectre controlling you? Their name is Tap Tap. They can't talk to us. However, they can hear and see everything. I'm delighted to have you here, Tap Tap. <laughs> Ending one, just immediately beaten by the batter. I'm delighted to have you here, Tap Tap. Nevertheless, explain why your sacred mission has led you here. This zone has been deserted for years. He looks like, due to the lines, he looks a little bit like Omori, doesn't he? Just do the little pant lines. You have something I need. For I am to purify the world, I need a Zodiac card to proceed. How do you know about the Zodiac cards? How does he know that? You're not supposed to know that. Well then, by coincidence, it is today that is truly an item I believe you are looking for. Yoink. You gave the batter a Zodiac card. Well, that was easy. I wish you the best in your... Yeah, the worst of... Bleh. I wish you the best of luck, foolish purificator. Your laudable quest is quite a... Now he's British. He wasn't British in the first dialogue. But he's gotten increasingly British. It is rather impossible to not let me and stop you from such endeavors. Thanks. <laughs> He didn't have the y yellow. Like, look at—he's got the little orange shoulder pants. He didn't have that before. Hmm. Interesting. No, for the fact, the main battle theme is made by him. It's kind of similar to Pepper Steak. Oh, that's cool. I'm gonna steal these before he can get to them. A luck tick has been found. Oh, nice! And it's got the little uh, the item things. I always appreciate that in one a piece of silver flat. <laughs> it's like a chicken. It's like one single chicken. They're a bit more edgy looking in one. I kind of like that in one. <laughs> why you gotta Why you gotta do me like that, bro? Hmm. An interesting man. His quest is noble yet impossible to accomplish. Is it though? No doubt his intrusions on this land will land him in a morgue. A sad funeral that no one should even visit. What a shame! Jesus Christ, man! You buried him. What do you think, Tap Tap? Shall I inquire as to your plans, O omnipotent guardian of the land? Ah, but alas, you can't speak to me. A rather inadequate display of raw competence. How about we use that cerebrum of yours? Complete the puzzles of this island or you'll be stuck wandering aimlessly across these yellow lands. Oh no! Cube! Do we do it? Your knowledge is on par with an average kitten. The stone is impossible to move. How dare you? I think I fucked it. Yeah, I think I was supposed to move it the other way. I hate these kind of puzzles. And this note seems to be plastered upon my wall. Should I read it? I want to thank you for taking the time to read this note. No problem, bro. Oh, speaking of um, notes, the um, there's a readme and a guide and a treasure chest in the folder. Um, I only read a little bit of the readme. I do know that there is music puzzles in the hard mode puzzle, which is part of why I didn't pick it. Because it says if you're hearing impaired, do not pick hard mode. It has musical and location hearing. Um, so we're not, I, I'm not a big fan, I've said in so many streams, I just, puzzles don't do it for me anymore, because it feels like work. Because I'm a programmer, and that's basically solving puzzles. It's got a little credits thing in the thing, there's a guide which explains some of the, um, status effects. There's a lot more status effects in this. Anyway. Really means... A lot to me to see people who show love and interest for this great game. Felix is a great person and friend. Oh, I think this is from Tiny Ghosty. Um, it always helped those who needed it, myself included. He helped build this community and showed us that we are free to 
be creative in a time where those who dared to make a fan game were frowned upon. Yeah, man, fan games? <laughs> fan games have definitely come up in the world a lot since. I remember it being like, like ROM hacks. And, like, people were like, man, ROM hacks, that's like illegal, man. Um, I'm pretty sure I just have to push the puzzle, the box on the thing. I, I just pushed it to the corner and I, it's trapped now. <laughs> I, I can solve the puzzle, I'm just reading the box. Um, but yeah, fan games, when I started out, people were like, aren't ROM hacks and Let's Plays like illegal? Like, isn't it, man? You, you can't do that, man. It's copywritten, man. And things have gotten <laughs> so much more positive. It's so weird because, like, people, like, God, like, NeoGAF and stuff, like, big forums were like, Let's Plays. Like, that's th that's just copyright violation. You shouldn't be allowed to do that. And now everything is like, oh, man, we're going to pay this guy $1,000 to stream our dumb game where you, like, throw rocks at people. <laughs> and so, and fan games, um, well, fan games... They're a lot more accepted by the community. Um, Sega accepts fan games. Nintendo is a little bit shittier, but um, I haven't heard of any major shutdowns from Nintendo. But off, um, I don't. I doubt Mortis Ghost would go that way. Anyway, hi Parky, hi Parky, yes. Yeah, fun fact, my, my channel more or less started with fan games, um, with ROM hacks. Um, my first game was Kirby, and then I think, um, Syra and Gish and Cave Story, but then there was a bunch of, uh, Mario ROM hacks that I played. Which are basically fan games. The only real difference is what engine. Like, a ROM hack is essentially a fan game made on the original game's engine. But you know what? You could say this is too, but that's, you just don't have to, there's no ROM, so there's no... You know, ROM to hack. Without his involvement, many of these games we, we have come to love and cherish today probably wouldn't exist. What you are playing now is a memorial version of Home. The sports that I suddenly made have been updated considering I have long since improved my original contributions. This wonderful project. A right, tiny, tiny ghosty makes boss ass enemy sprites. Um, the new version of Off, there's a lot of. Oh, uh, there's some really good horror creatures in there. In fact, I was, I, was, I was slightly underwhelmed by some of the original sprites in Off after seeing that. Um. Ghosty kind of started out with a bunch of like, kind of off, trying to copy off style, and then with the new update, it's all, it's all her own style, and it's a lot more um, horror themed. Mew. Which is a lot more fitting of the mood of the game, really. Mew. Mew. Because <laughs> if you think off is grim, but one get off is more more it's psychologically grim. It's more meta grim stuff. The actual game, there is some horror elements, but it doesn't get too crazy. But one, mew. One gets pretty dark. I don't know how dark this one gets. Like I said, this is my first time playing it. Hi, Parky. And this was a collaborative effort. Most fan games are. Um, some are like one person things. But yeah, this was definitely a big collaboration. There's a bunch of, uh, well, not a huge one. But uh, there's a little over a dozen different people mentioned in the credits. I've also taken time to find any bugs that I may have missed since the game's last update. Should people consider this disrespectful of me? But please know I did this out of love. Uh, I'd love my heart for someone to help me out that I miss dearly. Yeah, this isn't distributed publicly at the moment. Tiny Ghosty said people might think it's weird or whatever, but I I welcome this kind of stuff personally. Um, I just made to stone... This, this version is only made available to stone unless others show interest. That's me! The link will never be posted to public by my hands. And unless Tiny Ghosty says it's okay or, you know, something like that, uh, I probably won't be posting it either, but we will ah, see it. This stupid backrest on my chair it if you actually use it as a backrest it like pops out all the time thank you all so much i hope you all continue to love this game rest in peace you like you'll never be forgotten but hi parky mew hi parky okay so let's leave the room back in now i love it there's only one move that could have possibly made that puzzle impossible from the first from the very beginning as of course, immediately what I did. Okay, so it's, oh wait. Maybe there are multiple impossible moves, Never mind. Okay. I, <laughs> I'm already glad. Hang on, my stupid backrest thing. Like one side pops out and then the other side pops out. I don't know why it's like this, hang on. So we got, from right out of the gate, we got uh, Pokemon Crystal ice block puzzles. Very glad I picked it hard puzzle difficulty. 
High Park Kid. <laughs> Remember the Amori ice puzzles? I like those ice puzzles because they're basically a complete fake out. Like, they're, they're not actually puzzles, they're just a joke. I wish more puzzles were like that. Hi, Parky. Woo! Yeah, puzzles just feel like work that I don't get paid for. So I'm not a big puzzle fan. What's your favorite fan game, by the way, chat? I think it's this. I think this is how we do it. Yep, there we go. I keep getting Chinese mobile game ads. Oh, hey, Blue. <laughs> you know, <laughs> whoop. Okay. Invisible path. Definitely heavier on the puzzles than the original off. Oh, come on. There. Okay. No. They're very much. Oh, you butt. Very much more focused on the puzzles than the original off was. Okay. Oh, now it's Simon says. You gotta have some Simon says. Oh. Oh, come on. Cube? A door opened somewhere. I love how video game characters just have this knowledge. Yep, a door opened somewhere. Here we go. What's all this about? Excellent job, tap tap. Your ability of touching and pawing at my various stones is impressive. Now let us flick this switch. Oh, the switch is off, I don't like that. Oh yeah, I never played Pokemon Uranium. That got shut down along the same time as AM2R. I love that game, I streamed that by the way. That's um, one of the last big fan games I did a stream of, in fact. I've had a bunch of fan games. There, it's a home one, continue, stop, rise. I've only played one so far. And now this, of course. Tap tap. Something's wrong, tap tap. Skull probs and aches in the most violent manner. Oh, pixel. I got the pixel brains. Oh! Your time is coming, Judge. This land is crumbling before our very eyes. You sit back and do nothing. The guardians of this land will fail their jobs. What will you do? Will you save the world, or will you fail? Just like they have. The choice is yours. Oh, batter. Batter be working fast. Something is terribly wrong, Tap Tap. The northern door placed before us is the way we must go. Let us make a haste to aid Sword our next destination. Person likes fan games like this, but overall, you mean. Yeah, Yumi Nikki fan games are great. I, I played a bunch of those before. In fact, one of my whole year's worth of Halloween streams was like almost entirely Yumi Nikki fan games. So I'm looking through the credits. I, I, Tiny Ghosty goes by a lot of names at this point. But Chimakisane slash Blackfire. Uh, Monster Sprite Plague Doctors, I believe, is uh, now mostly called Tiny Ghosty and just the off creator. <laughs> so I never finished one because I kept getting it stuck in places. Yeah, she's removed... Um, some of the more annoying puzzles have been removed in uh, in 5.0 that's not out yet. Um, you can check my video. Um, I, I complete all of the puzzles and everything. There's one particularly rough one that I got stuck on that I know was removed. Um, or was changed very drastically. I forget exactly what it is, but it's not the same as it was. So that for me remembering me to the entirety of my health and competence points, it's capable of saving our progress and sending us to the nothingness. I think this is a limbo portal world between zones that define our world. Do not worry, I travel all well through the different zones of the world, dear Tap Tap. But it's not a harmful device. Let's carry towards the destination that is Zone One. Guardian here must be warned. Interesting that this is, this is at least somewhat written that you could kind of like. It's not entirely expecting you to know everything from off. Whoa, different. Zone Three. Oh, they're even more plant-like now. 
world map question mark i always like that so it's interesting to see this world map after we saw that little uh let me see do i still have that on my desktop um i had a little graphic from mortis himself um that i showed last time i don't think i still have it up but it's kind of like um the room was a bunker and everything was like plants i played hollow knight or hades not yet I did play some of the earlier games by the developers behind Hades. Can I just go to the wrong zone? Oh, no. What do you mean zone 4? What do you mean zone 4? I've heard Hades is really good. It's a roguelike though, isn't it? I don't usually... That's usually a bit frustrating for me. Ah, the delicious watermelon flavors of zone 1. Hey, Elsons. Welcome to Elson. This vehicle is the train. It's really useful if you want to get around zone 1. Please set clear your destination. There we go. Zone 1. So I guess this is going along the same time as the batter. Which makes sense because the judge does kind of like go around and do things. It's interesting because he... He and... Um, Mew. He, the guardians to some extent. And... Um, Zachary seem to be the only ones that are like really move around and stuff. Moo! Hi, Parkle Beast. What do you want? Mew! Mew! Mew, mew, mew. Zone 4 is the one about suicide. <laughs> Alright. I guess keep that in mind. But if you stuck around for my Amori streams, you can probably handle. Oh, um, another visitor? Another? By the way, how's, my, how's our audio balance? It looks alright, I think, on the things, but I'm just trying a new audio thing. So there should be no more moments where, like, you can't hear things, because I... It's based on how I hear things. Hi, Parky. Hi, Parky. Parker's like, you're streaming too early, you gotta pet me more. Yes. Another? I, um, uh, welcome to the smoke mines. May I know why you're here? Are you someone's pet? No, I'm the judge, Parky. Are you the judge? You're not the judge. You you have colors. Get no, get off my keyboard. Get off the keyboard. I'm doing things, honey. The judge, guardian. What is a cat doing here anyway? What does the judge do? My fine humanoid sack of meats. <laughs> That's a gender neutral greeting. If you need one, by the way. How do you do, my fine humanoid sack of meat? I want you to protect. Them. My land, and to do so, I'm looking for the Guardian of Zone 1. He is not necessarily hard, just needs you to adapt. It's a bit challenging at the beginning. This one is an option called God Mode. When you die, your God resistance goes up. Huh. That's neat. I appreciate when, when um, roguelikes are a bit more accessible, because I usually just don't have the time to spend, like, 18 billion years. Like, I spent, um... I think Binding of Isaac is really... That and some old mystery dungeon games are about the only roguelikes that I've fully completed. I... Who sent you? Nobody sent me. I'm in quest on my own regard. Tap Tab is the one aiding my actions. I don't know them. They sound very important, though. Um, you're at the smoke mine. The smoke mines of Damien. The south part of Zone 1. GTA played Red Dead 2. Nah. B big open world games. I can play like one or two of those a year. And I had already played um, Death Stranding and stuff. And I was like, eh. It's... I got kind of burnt out on the whole GTA style thing with uh, after San Andreas. I played the whole GTA trilogy on PS2. And then I was like, okay. Time, time for different games. Here we sent workers into deep tunnels that unearthed metal from the ground. Freeing embedded smoke that was trapped in the depths. He's got more colors. The colors are disconcerting me. Enough explanatory chatter. I know the situation of the existence... The situation of existence is if it itself works. I... What? There's no need to wither my ears off with your endless ramblings. Judge is kind of a prick, though. All I need to know is where the Guardian Zone was. I must speak with him. Um... You might be past the mines, but they're blocked off at the moment. Sorry, I can't help you. Whatever. Puny flesh bag, allow me access to your chest. What is the feline doing in Damien? 
See, they got colors. They didn't have colors. But oh, clever dick. Oh, just a luck ticket. Uh, the thing is, like, I games. I, I can't deal with games that are too long, more or less. Um, I, <laughs> there's so many games. Oh, very. Oh, I guess we do meet you here, don't we? It's very, very ominous to just suddenly run into the batter, especially when you know when he does it. Hi, Parky. Meow. Yeah. <laughs> I, was, <laughs> I, was, I was not expecting that. Bleh. Have you spotted the chief of the specters? By what do you mean? I'm deeply sorry to speak the truth, for neither man nor ghost has been spotted around here. Yeah. Hmm. Do you know where he might be? The purring. I just arrived here and I have not a clue what such, as, what such a being might be. Hmm? Oh! Phantasmagorial beings! Oh, there they be! Seems the phantoms have appeared before us. Tap tap, do you possess the knowledge to, to grapple and battle such beings? No tutorial. Last time I was in a combat tutorial, I got a game over, so. Oh, we got a we got a cat's eye. Mundane Spectre. <laughs> Ow. Bleh. The sounds are even meatier than usual. Battle time. You gotta love the battle time. You gotta love that. Adversary is defeated. Oh, defeated, not purified. 3,000 experience gained, 2,000 credits, blah, blah, blah. Waking Ravage has been learned. <laughs> <laughs> Took you long enough. I'm deeply sorry that I do not make a living out of Spectre slaying. Maybe you could have aided Tap Tap instead of standing there holding a bat in such a mundane and pointless manner. <laughs> <laughs> not my man, not my problem. Well, there are no more Spectres down here. My mission guides me onwards. I'll see you later, Judge. <laughs> Bye. Oh! <laughs> little jump spook there for you. Hey, you're the- Hey, you're the talking cat. So a man with a baseball came by, he's gonna kill the chief of the specters. How generous of him. Oh, are you not happy the lines are clear now? I shouldn't let you in, but I already let that man go by, so... Good, well, the, the mines are on the right. Okay. Oh! Ghost recently came out of the mines. I'm fully aware of this. I don't know where this man, he, he struck the specters who looked to, with what looked to be a bat. So much to my surprise, the spirit let out a yell and vanished out of existence. Here, I thought the specters were untouchable. Very well then, I must be going. Be, be, uh, uh, be safe in there. Dangerous cats also spotted down there. Dangerous cats. Y you could do something about them, you're a cat yourself. What are you trying to say, bro? You think just because I'm a cat I know them? It's racist, bro. Oh! Valerie? Cats have been spotted in the mines. Is it the phantasms weren't enough trouble? Cats, ghosts, same same threat level. Maximum threat level, of course. Lamps don't always work in the eastmost and most corridors. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Man holding a bat was bumbling. The chief of specters. Get water. What do you mean, get water? Oh, oh, to fight the cats. I see what you mean. The phantoms in every corridor, be careful, blah, blah, blah. Besides, who let you enter here? Normally the regulations prohibit external visitors, let alone a cat. Look, I'm a cat. I do as I please. I'm here to rub my face on boxes and claw table legs, okay? Oh. oh the music goes directly into my brain. Stone is impossible to move. There's nothing in this. There's something in this box. You got credits. Oh, there's a train, guys. There's a train inside my head. Some sound effects feel very weird when you're wearing headphones. Oh, let's see if that secret is still in here. Oh, it's a ghost cat. I, I guess I see what they mean by cats. Oh, that was weird. The battle theme is called She is Dancing Until Her Head Explodes. Ah, yes. A Joker has been found. 
Whoa. The song makes me feel weird. It's very intense. I'm being productive. Please let me work. Uh, let's see what these things are called. Look at that happy little man down there. Ow. Burnt cat. Lost and hopeless cat. There's a lot... <laughs> There's a lot of cat-related things. I played Monster Hunter stories. I played only one. I got the Wii U Monster Hunter game because it was cheap. And I I wasn't a huge fan. Again, open world. I guess it's more of a, its own thing. Hey, Valerie. Um, any, anything with, like, huge amounts of grind. Oh! <laughs> this one makes it much more apparent. But I knew, the, I knew about this from the main game. What's up, guys? Get out. Get out of here. I've had enough of you stray cats running around the mines. What did you open the door for? Oh, jeez, Rick. I don't think there should be cats in the mines. They could they could get the fur and the, the, the equipment. We're safe here. We'll have to escape once we run out of meat. Maybe we can eat you? No? Oh, see, this is why it tracks. Um, usually, if you're making an RPG, what you need to do is keep track of where in the song you were when a random encounter occurs, because then otherwise the song loops every time, and then you don't get to hear the last part of the track usually. So much smoke to trap within the rocks. Beautiful smoke, please come out to play. Well, that's weird. Oh, eyes. <laughs> there he is, he'd be looking for us. I'm doing pretty good. Turn this down just slightly. A watchful eyeball that crawls around. Turn it up a bit for you. I'm still getting used to this new. Well, not new. I used to record sound for this for streams like years ago. But I haven't done it in quite a while now. I'm having a pretty good day. I'm dry. I hate winter. I'm getting a third humidifier. Hopefully that is enough. I think the problem is just my downstairs is... Like, there are basically no doors. So it's like one gargantuan room. So all of the air circulates through that, and so the humidifiers don't really do a lot. Cat friend, come here. I want to hiss at you and run around. And put my ears down. What? How are people making through the smoke mines? Did a young man come brandishing a bat come by? Well, why, why, yes, he said he was looking for a certain chief of the specters. He seemed rather lost. Yes, yes, he's certainly a man of few words and fewer brain cells. <laughs> Can you tell me the direction in which he traveled? Uh, I can't. Just why not? Who are you? You sent by the queen? Or by the Dan? The Dan. Ah, oh, yes, that is the guardian of the zone. Uh, I said too much. I could get fired. This must be from this conversation. Dismissed from mind, this conversation. Tell me where better meant. He, uh, we have specters in our big barns. He went to cleanse them. Barns? Yes, to, to the right. Th thanks, bro. Get ready for cow meat sounds. Yeah. These boulders don't get any lighter. So heavy. It's half a cow. Sorry, I can't lay through right here right now. Nice to work out here with, rather than the smoke mines. The air is so much better. Sound of Tears has been found. Wonderful. Sound of Tears. It's like the sound of music, but it's tears. Gotta love the meat sound. Oh! There's that man! He's got colors. It's so weird to see them with colors. But I guess it's, it's probably supposed to be like a perspective thing. Like the batter sees things in black and white. Mostly. Hello there, sir. What the fuck is going on here? Uh, uh, my man came by. He's in the barns right now. He, he said he'd help with specters. How long has this shit stain been poking around in there? <laughs> yeah, this is original to Dan. Like I said, this is more towards the um, the original Reconstructed Dragon translation than the more recent one we played. So to Dan's probably going to swear a lot more. <laughs> Not long. Of course, you know nothing. Worthless piles of crud. Crud? He, he'll eliminate the specters. Of all the stupid, idiotic things I've heard today, it makes a cake, icing and all. Think he's better than me? Ain't nobody stronger than me. No, I, I, don't, I don't think that... Good. I have to evaluate your position here if you think anyone is tougher than me. 
I got a little more gangster than I intended there, and I don't think it's going away. You're a bunch of weaklings anyway. I feel like I'm doing Jawsome's voice. You signed your contracts. This is new, but forget it. I mean, it's deader than hell. What? what? You don't think you'll make it a come out of here alive? Of course not. Nobody can fight the specters except the envoys of the queen herself. That prig in there is no envoy of her majesty. Who's going to help us get rid of the phantoms? Would have done it myself. I'm not a rush a sack of shit like the lot of you. You're just going to have to deal with it yourselves. Uh, uh, no. P -p oh. <laughs> oh, no! Anyone else care to speak up? Didn't think so. I'll be heading to Sachihatia. You prigs are he stay here to stay here to clean out the meatworks by yourself. P please don't. If I catch you so much as speaking with the man inside, I'll have your head. No, don't. Piss off. <laughs> Rest in peace, Elson number 347. I'll, I'll get up. Oh, did you hear that sound? Eventually. <laughs> Yeah, like I said, probably all based on probably the first or second version of the translation. I know what's the differences in the second translate? I don't think I ever played the second version of the translation. Please run along now. These balls are clusters of work metal, which, which are going to be sent to other zones. It's a uh, metallic. Thanks. The ominous redness under the, the, the cube is is unnerving. So strange. You would think the meat would come from such a plump and fleshy animal something in the barns right now purification in progress there he go adversary is purified <laughs> i like the idea that he says that to himself valerie get, get, get becky what are you doing it's dangerous that guy's weird don't rub your face on him oh, valerie get Cubes? Oh, strength puzzles. You gotta have strength puzzles, of course. Oh, shit. Okay. N no. Soiled it. Soiled it! Soiled it! Okay. There we go. All by itself. What strange sights is he in, in this lieu? <laughs> Which is an unnecessarily fancy... Who? You're not Valerie. Um, what an unnecessarily fancy way to mean place. But yes, that's what lieu means. So when you say in lieu of, you mean in place of. Another cat. No, wait. You're different. Grin is too wide. Teeth are so sharp. Sharper than mine. You look healthy. Clearly not from around here. They're coming. The dead. Their unfortunate end. I caused it. Now they haunt me. Their thirst for revenge rivals my hunger for meat. <laughs> they seek your vibrant flesh just as I sought theirs. But why are the cats? There better not be catabolism here. I don't like that. I better scan him, huh? Phantom cat. Spectral purring creature. Light weakness against the meat. Give us the meat, human. Very easy so far. I, I, maybe I could have picked, like, the hard difficulty for combat, but eh. I don't want to have to grind too much. Hopefully not at all. Just not too exciting for a stream. You erased them. They were once my friends. Guilty as I am, their leader. I was in control. I was to lead them to feasts, but I led them to their graves. Oh, so he was like leader. He didn't eat them. They were just like stupid and died. I can feel them. More are coming. They want you to stay here forever. Oh no. Sad cat noises are not fair. You're not allowed to have them in your game. Minor impact. Ow. Okay, we don't have any AoE attacks, so I guess it doesn't really matter too much what we do. Just deals just slightly more damage. 
we use a skill, I guess. Bonk. It's a little lower tempo. It's not bad music, though. Hard to beat Pepper Steak. It's classic. You, you're strong. You erased them all. I'm free. Their ghostly bodies no longer haunt me. I need meat. I need it so badly. Give it me at it all and I'll let you go. I refuse to give it your demands and feed your devious habits. Such a shame. I'll just eat you instead. Oh no. Back away, you miserable runt. Woo. Boss time. Angry cat. Ow. Whoops to you. Elaine. Insane feline suffering from starvation light we just against meat. I wonder if we're gonna get meat like the four elemental cats. The meat cat, the smoke cat, the plastic cat, and the metal cat. Possibly the secret sugar cat. Maybe we're one of the elemental cats, though. I don't know what our element is. Cheeto cat. I'm not sure Cheeto is one of the, f the four elemental goddesses or whatever. Ow. Should probably heal, huh? Yeah. Ow. Boodaloop. Voice hurting. There we go. It is neat it does have difficulties though. A lot of RPGs don't, just because I guess they figure, you know, you can just grind. It's not always exactly the case. Brutal claw received. Stop. I'm sorry. Everything's so dark. My bones are so empty. My stomach is an abyss. Such a pitiful creature you are. Take me with you and I'll help you out. You find food together. Please don't let me starve. Even the contingency of this odd predicament, I'll have you join in my inquisition. Tap, tap, certainly. You have no quarrels with such a joining member joining my ranks. Yes? Who is tap, tap? I see no one else here. Tap, tap is an omnipotential guardian. He will guide our steps and should you join our travels. Fair enough. Join the cat with the funny vocabulary and his imaginary friend. The, Elaine just joined the party. That does seem like a not not possibly the best, you know, idea. But it's like, eh, what else am I gonna do? Better than starving. Sharp claw. Oh, he's got a good claw. A little concerned how we're like unequipping our claws. It seems weird, but all right, strength puzzle. Easier to get out than in. Elaine can heal himself. Let's check out the stats. Leeching Palpit. It's physical type of absorbing damage. Meat element. He is the elemental meat cat. I guess we're smoke. We got smoke. At least we got one smoke attack. It's possible we just get all of the skills because we're... Uh, look at our little legs. Because we, uh, we're we the leader. Can I, oh! That's weird. Oh, oh, now the row command works. Wait, what the hell? Oh, somebody has to be in the front row. Okay. Huh. I, th I thought the row command just didn't do anything, but no, it's just somebody has to be in the front row. I think Final Fantasy is like that, too. A thick coat has been found. Is that just... But... Defensive equipment, too. I'm just, I'm just not going to think about that. I don't feel like thinking about that. It seems like a bad idea. <laughs> you okay, buddy? I'll I'll get up eventually. I like that pause there. All right. Someone made our boss angry. We're trapped here until the meat works to open up. Can I go? Yep. Figured. Cow. It's the year of the cow. Ox, actually, but close enough. It's the year of the general bovine, if you will. General Bovine. Hello there. Hey, it's you! It's Mr. Mean Man himself. My, 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 what a cute little bundle of cats you are. It's just two. It's hardly a bundle. I beg your pardon. I'm a cat myself, you know. 
I like to scratch the legs of my customers. I love to nuzzle their chest so they don't pay attention to me. It's, it's a little weird, Zachary, but okay. Zachary, please quit the antics. Meow. Meow. Oh, don't do that, please. I'm not Zachary. I'm a cute feline like yourself. I can purr and nuzzle and travel anywhere you can. Zachary, take off that ridiculous mask of feline origin. Look preposterously ignorant. Aw. <laughs> Yo. Fine, fine. I was just trying to make our friend tap tap laugh, that's all. <laughs> well, I guess he succeeded. Look at that banshee, Pablo. You know the drill. I'm the merchant, you're the customer. Ship me credits, and I'll shave my stock. Buenos dias. I just wanted to do more, more uh, Greg voice. A plastic coat. Yeah, I got a plastic coat. Sound of blood. And we got a. Already got one of those, I guess. Magical equipment. Offensive. You get one seeking fang. I guess. Another sound of blood. That'll do. Oh, before you go, take this book. Check your items. A book named Phantasmagorials will be within your... Oh, sweet! Is it a bestiary? A pungent smell of raw metal fills this place. Okay. Uh, seeking Fang. Oh, I see! So there's magical and physical equipment now. And there's very large discrepancy in stats between them. Jeez. Wait, didn't I get a collar? Whatever, sound of blood, plastic coat. I could have swore it told me I had a collar already, but whatever. <laughs> Send a tears. I don't need too many tears. Uh. I don't like to sell my equipment, even if it's worthless. Equipped. Oh, I misread. I thought I possessed one, but no, it's just I have one equipped. Oh, well. If the game seems a little difficult, I might grind a bit off-screen. Off-screen. Off the carcass of an animal split in half. How did they get three halves of cows, though? Like, the math doesn't add... Oh. Uh oh, I don't like this room. Yeah, let's not be in this room anymore. Check the book. Oh, hang on. Oh! The metal is tainted! The metal is tainted! I beg your pardon? Out of my way, out of my way! Uh oh, burnt. <laughs> there he is! There's our first burnt. Oh, he surprised us. Makes sense. Oop. Leeching palpit. Technicolor yawn. It's contagious. Oh, let me scan. Watchful burnt. Alien ploy of zone one. Oh, I'm dying. I'm dying, Squirtle. Uh, objects, luck ticket. I gotta buy some luck tickets, I guess. Maybe we do need a little grind here. Yeah, I'll check the book in a second here. I think we may, like, want to grind, like, at least one level or two on the specters. The butcher's coming. Oh, come on. Well, now there's ghosts here. Like, turtles. Heavy specter. Gravity-affected ectoplasmic inhibition. Light resistance gets smoke. I like totals. Alright, I feel like we should grind at least a level or two on like baby mode enemies, because we're getting into critical health pretty quickly. No, stop that, please. Um, let's heal up. And let's check out that book. Phantasmagorials! There are only two chapters in this book. Phantoms and their weaknesses. Those goral beings are weak against magical and spectral abilities. Stu 
to their very soul be exposed. Okay, so ghosts are weak to magic. Makes sense. Such a thing is very dangerous. We do not recommend ever exposing your soul to your enemies. Anyway, as we carry on. Ghosts are weak against anything magic-based. If it reads magical damage of a sword, you can bet you're sorry behind it'll do a lot more damage against the specter. The book seems unreadable past this point. Wait, so does my regular attack turn magical then? If I use a magical thing, or does it just have stronger attack when I use magic? Let's read the other one. Phantoms and their strengths. If you ever crossed a phantom, you already know that they pack quite a phantasmagorial punch. Such is their nature. However, they're also very resistant to the physical world, sadly. Might and Braun aren't enough to deal with these beings. They're very resistant to physical blows. It reads physical damage. You're sorry, behind's going to be pathetic. Yeah. Expected. Okay. Well, let's see. Judge, I believe. No. Elaine should deal a lot more damage than Judge, if that's the case. Let's just get away from that. Oh, wow. Okay, yeah, it does do an elemental damage then. Okay, that's good to know. So when you're fighting specters, which is presumably most things, question mark? Like, maybe the Elsons, maybe the Burnts aren't spectral. Hmm. Huh? Hey, wait a minute. Oh, that was a miss. Wait, no, Elaine is dealing less damage. So is that not a specter? No, I, I I got that mixed up. I think okay. I think you have to use magic, then. Let's confirm this theory before we go on, though. All right, so now Elaine should deal damage more in line with the judge. Oh, I think Elaine is just like a lot weaker. It didn't seem to matter much either way, though. What are your stats, then? Wait, his attack is way higher, but his... Oh, it's his spirit. Okay. Okay, so Judge just has crazy more spirit. So does spirit always deal more? Huh, interesting. Oh, wait, no, I did give him. No, oh, no, it's because I gave him that. Never mind. Wait. Wait, 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 wait. Hang on. Hang on. I think I, I think I equipped on the wrong person. All right, so neither of them is wearing the magical thing now. Hedgehogs! Now, they're more like chameleons, I think. Oh, another hedgehog. Spike hogs. Spiky ghoul with a warm smile. Aw. All right, so 100 damage from Elaine. Okay, so you do deal more magical damage with the thing. Okay. Okay, I, I just equip. I didn't realize who I equipped it on. Spike hogs. All right, hang on. Let me refill my drink here. See you, Jake. Let me BRB here.
I'm just kind of like allergic to everything, to life. So my, my one of my nostrils is like permanently closed, almost. So sometimes on stream I get a, a I just use a nasal strip so my voice doesn't sound nasally. I got some hot cider. I got some well, this is just cider, but you heat it up in the microwave a little bit. It's surprisingly good. All right, let's get out of here. That works with um, like um, Angry Orchard um, hard cider too. But oh no, um, I I don't microwave it in the bottle. That seems dangerous, but. I pour it out into a microwave safe thing, heat it up a bit, it's, it's good. A seeking fang. Well, I'm glad that I didn't buy another one of those then, because we just got it. Money saved. Oh! Spike hog. I think I'll use the auto a bit more so I... <laughs> this, I, I know what the zero is now, but it's still always infuriating to see. Like, my brain is like, oh no! It's like you're attacking an adamantois that has, you know, perfect defense up or something. Yeah, cider is way better hot, in my opinion. Just cook it. Um, basically, put it in the microwave for about the same time that you would tea. It might come out a little too hot, but you can just let it cool. F figure out the, the temperature you like the most. Switch has been pressed. I like how it doesn't say the switch has been turned off. It makes it a little bit different from batter. Yeah, they just had these big old jugs of cider at uh, High V when I last went shopping. I was like, huh, well, I'll try some. And yeah, it was pretty good. Mr. Cows. What's up, cows? How you doing? In we go. Zoop! Up. Oh. Hang on. Let me see that again. Zoop! Oh, come on. There we go. Hey, dude. Health points, confidence fully restored, blah, blah, blah. I figured why not put like the Discord thing down there on the bottom, by the way. It's a little, it's not quite perfectly centered though, is it? Let me like, yeah, it looks better. That's where we came from, of course. Oh, oh, you can cheat, you can see it, you can see it. it's a little, there you go. Darkness maze. There's got to be a darkness maze, of course. This is probably a standard for off games now because of that mall. Oh, half a cow. If for some reason, it's half a cow is much more amusing to me. So I've never actually seen the original sprites, which how many are, were done by, um, by tiny ghosty slash fire? Um... These ones that we've seen so far, a lot of them do remind me of her style. But I don't know which ones have changed because I never played the original. <laughs> oh. You, you, <laughs> you cool fam? His body is slashed into a hideous condition. He is undoubtedly dead. He'll be alright. This big boy drinks lots of milk. You're a big guy! For you. A lot of them seem the same so far, at least the Spike Hogs were. With the game on like Office, quite a few mini bosses, so expect some along the way. Alright. Yeah, I'm just trying to kind of slightly grind, I suppose. The box room. Box. Oh, it's not a strength puzzle. Anybody got HM05? Whatever Flash was. <laughs> oh, it's adorable. Who's this man? Shy Spectre. Bashful Ectoplasmic Incarnation. It's a boo.
I love that like Beavis and Butthead grin the judge has. He's like, oh, oh, oh. I was speaking of Beavis and Butthead. I was playing um, Firefight, Halo Reach Firefight with a buddy. And um, I didn't realize that in Firefight your character like giggles and stuff when you get a head when you get a headshot. So our characters were right next to each other and we could hear each other like giggling every couple seconds, like Beavis and Butthead, just like <laughs> Guns are cool. The heavy specters we saw at bed ago are different. Oh, I should get going. Yeah, I think it's just Tiny Ghosties ones that were updated. Because, like the note said. Oh, I should get going. Uh oh. You, you alright, you right, buddy? Flesh, it slices away so nicely. B b b back away, I must return to work. Come back! No! Oh. <laughs> I'm sorry, but that's impossible to take seriously. Blood. Such a beautiful substance. Game name's always in the um, title. Blood. Let it flow out in beautiful splashes. This man's state of mental state. This man's mental state is beyond repair. At least eat the meat. Leave such carcasses out to rot is such a waste. I don't like our new friends. <laughs> oh, cats. Come here, little kitties. Such small, fragile little bodies. Crunching your small bones under the weight of my knife. So beautiful. I shall erase your bloodstained body from this world, wicked man. There he is. He's got the claw hand. Did you notice that some of the uh, burnts, their claws are a lot like, um... <laughs> His eyes. Um... Not like the ducky batter. Burn butcher. Bloodthirsty worker of the meatworks. Real name Pentel. <gasps> oh no! Guys, Pentel. Where's Damien at? Fierce homing. Oh, neat. They're honing, not homing. All right. Meat. He's probably not weak to meat. Oh, but I heal though. Uh, nice to use skills, I guess. Oh, I just realized this guy, he's a burnt, so he's probably. For a brief moment, I thought that was an air horn. Um, thanks to Omori. I was expecting an air horn noise after that. <laughs> it, it sounds like the start of an air horn. Why is it so silent? I mean, this track is pretty quiet. I can turn it up a little bit. It's kind of just, just quiet, though. You can't hear it, though. Like, you hear, like, the blood splats when the attacks happen. Like, I'm looking at the track. It's not dead silent. Oh, my eyes. My eyes. Yeah, I think this is supposed to be... Sometimes silence is spookier. Does sound almost like an air. Uh oh, let's luck dick it. <laughs> that default RPG maker sound effect seems so out of place. Oh, I'm broken. What? What do you mean broken? Here's appearance change in their status. Selene's. So yeah, that's that's neat. Ow. That's something to an extent that uh, one carries over, I believe. Of course it missed it though. I think that does just slightly more damage. I wonder if this is one of those games where you can change equipment mid battle. No, of course it's not. Abscond? <laughs> what, what do you mean abscond? Ow. Ow. Oh. No experience for a lane. Platinum flesh. Don't you hate that? Oh, that's not very nice of you. <laughs> this land, it's been a long time since I traveled. Never did I expect to see such horrors. I've seen worse. <laughs> Thanks, buddy. Let's just carry on. We have further to travel into this zone. It's a sparkle. These, these red dots seem very important and common. 
What's this? Abscond is run. Oh, oh yeah, I think one does that too. A pouch of catnip has been found. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. What's that do? Powder then flicks insanity into the targets. <laughs> okay. Huh. Return to entrance. Oh, thanks. But hang on, I want to read this first. It's a note. Hear their voices. Spectres are within me. Can't avoid their call. They want me to kill. Blood, bone, flesh. They want me to rip it all clean. Can't withstand their call. I must do their bidding. Pentel. So the butcher's name was Pentel. Spectre this zone infected his brain and caused him to kill the workers beneath him. A tragic story indeed. Huh. So this is going with the spectres caused the burnt. I always just kind of figured the burnt as just like a natural physiological thing that happens if you, um, when, when Elsons get a lot of stress. Because it only seemed to happen to Elsons. The one has kind of a take on that as well. The pungent smell of raw meat. Or metal. Same thing. Yeah, it's got a plastic coat. And a collar. Joker. I should probably get a few of these too. Yeah. Get that collar. Sound of blood. Seeking. Hmm. So I assume most of the bosses probably will be. So I should probably change equipment for the bosses, but. Hard to know when that'll be. Yep, that's Zachary. Can I go... Can I go up here now, buddy? So, did you clear the meatworks for us? Indeed. Your nasty ectoplasmic infestation is now in a controlled state. No thanks are needed. I just need the direction to the garden of the zone, to Dan. He's over in the next section. And normally you'd take the train to it. Sadly, the past the tramway is blocked. You'll have to take the mines. They're open now that the specters are under control. Yeah, my thanks, fine worker. Ah, we're back to the mines. Sound of blood sounds metal as fuck. <laughs> it's very meaty. Yep, back we go along the batter's path. Oh, this track is so... It's in my brain. You can feel it in my brain. How is the audio balance, by the way? Because I was... I did ask about that. Nobody, ah! ah why, why, why is it, a, like, on the map? Did you guys see that? It scared the hell out of me. A piece of silver flash has been found. Like, this should be moderately loud. Like, like you should definitely be able to hear this. Ugh. Okay, it's just normal burnts. Okay. So things can just be on the battle square, the, on the world map in this, like Earthbound. Adversary is defeated. I'm feeling like we should maybe- oh. <laughs> this game likes its jump spooks. Um, what was I about to say? Um, I've had a lot of long streams lately. I feel like we might do sh kind of shorter things. So I might finish a zone per stream, not counting zone zero, because that would be like a hilariously short stream. But I think we might finish this zone and go for like one zone per stream. I'm not sure if I'll stream tomorrow, because I've been streaming a lot, so it's kind of a maybe tomorrow. We might do Jackbox. Get in the Discord. Um, I'll get that link. Oh, oops. There we go. Get in the Discord if you want to play um, Jackbox. The one thing I do ask, like, read the room with when we play Jackbox games. It's a party game. It's, like, got Pictionary and... You know, games we try to lie to each other and like make the funniest lie and stuff. Um, just try to read the room. With the, the one, the only reason I don't like randos in that game is they usually, they just don't mesh well with the friend group. It, it is a game we play, you know, with friends. But if you watched a few of my streams, you probably have a decent understanding, of my sense of humor, and most of the people in my Discord obviously are at least somewhat used to my humor. Oh, 
Only level three. I do like when fan games try to like they ha they add a little of their own stuff, like the the the, the pop up enemies and stuff, the the item visuals and stuff. Because a lot of times you just get you get just more story crammed into the same exact engine. It's not always the worst thing, you know. I would say for an RPG fan game, usually it is the story that is the main event. But oh. Can't see anything. I must mine is my job. I'm gonna fix the lights. Is it just oh. Hi friend. Yeah, it's nice to see a fan game kind of expand on things more. What are the best Undertale fan games, by the way? I, I did I never played any Undertale fan ones. I know there's a bunch that are like focused just on like balls hard enemies. Luck ticket receive. Why is that an expression, by the way? Balls aren't that hard. Speaking of the the dumbest thing I've seen in my life, um, I I was at the the summer like pseudo college thing for smart kids, and um, <laughs> these two um, all uh, the, the nicest way I can describe it is they're exactly the sort of people who would kick each other in the balls for fun, and um, they they kicked each other in the balls for fun, and. They just did it, like, it, it, right there, and it was just, like, a casual thing. And <laughs> it was just, it was surreal to watch. And it was just like, are you, you, you okay, fam? And they, they were all right, but it's like, <laughs> that kind of hurts to watch. I, I, I it, it's bonding. I, I feel compelled to point out that I did not t take part in. Hey, kick me in the balls, buddy. <laughs> I don't think that's standard bonding. It sounds painful. It's it definitely is. Yes, I, I would not recommend it. Is this? I'm so lost. It's, stone is impossible. I like that it's a stone now. A piece of Abaddon's meat. So Abaddon's meat is steak, and silver flesh is chicken. I don't even know why they did it. They they weren't like mad at each other. They just I don't know. People be weird. It was kind of the two, there was kind of a group of four of us. There was the two big guys, and I was one of the two um, skinnier, nerdier guys. And we were, we were both of the not kick each other in the ball, balls, you know, propensity. So much meat noises in this game. Even more than the original off. So we may be streaming uh, Jackbox games, probably Jackbox 6 or 2, next uh, Saturday, probably at 4 p.m. Switch is not off. I don't... It's so ominous to read now. Oh yeah, that's exactly the same Switch that was in the original game. There we go. Oh, smoke boulder. I don't know chicken is named Silver Flesh. Silver Flesh. Silver Flash, it's Christmas time, Baduda. The mines in the west are so dark, I can't get back. Yeah, I don't recommend them mines. The Sound of Blood, I already got that. See, this game does kind of the same problem that I have with the original off. It's like, oh, I found an item that I could have bought from Zachary and did buy from Zachary 20 minutes ago, and I found it in a chest. It's like, oh, uh, uh, oh, no, you gotta, you gotta play more Final Fantasy, man. You, items and chests should be unique or at least always useful. Like, at the worst, give me like a high potion or something when a high potion is moderately useful. So how's your weekend, chat? I had a good time with Flash games yesterday. That was really fun. I wasn't sure how people would react to Flash Game Friday. I was hoping to get recommendations, and we did eventually. What a sound of blood. Well, it's basically, as we've heard several times, I'm a little busy here. He's jacking off in the shaft. Oh, spicy. He's, he's mining. He's mining for that meat, which is probably a real thing they do in this world. 
If I planted the wall, the specters won't mind me. You do you, buddy. Ooh! I like that. The hell is that man? Invertus. Ghoul with an inverted head. What <laughs> Silent Hill looking ass. I like him. Hello, the mobile speedrunner. I think we're mostly people here. And cats. More cats than usual today. Usually just one. Oh, Castle Crashers. I need to play that. I, I think I have it on PS3, maybe? But I haven't played it very much. It's one of those much better friends games, isn't it? I recorded, uh, I don't know if people look up stories um, on YouTube, the little like short videos you do. But um, I got one of Parker. He loves he loves getting into the cabinets. Even though he knows there's nothing in there, he just likes to be in there because they're not normally open. So he like opens it. Hey, Zach. <laughs> he just opens them. Show me your credits, mon ami. Er, show me your credits, mon ami. Um... Mammon speeds. Oh, right. Oh, hey. Excuse me. They all heal multiple things now since there's so many more. There's like twice as many. Um... Oh, neat. You can blind enemies now with with items. So I'm going to get... I'm guessing that means Zachary and a save point. Like, come on. There's got to be a uh, boss fight coming up. So let's switch to our attack clause. Watch this then, in fact, be a ghost boss. No, Hattie Haddington. I don't think that I do. Well, what are you doing here? I'm looking for a man. He's on a quest to purify the land. The land. He's here to kill the specters. I know where he is. He's currently inside the building. There's something big going on the postal service. The postal service. That's where you sent out the packet to four. And the, the problem is that nobody can remember which floor it can be found on. I heard that some of the workers on the ground floor spot the same number. That could be the floor number, uh, I suppose. I don't know, though. I'm down here all the time. Thanks, buddy. Hey, that's a better hint than the original game gives us. Oh, Battle Block Theater. Oh, I still need to play that, too. Is that the, um... Is that Stamper, the voice that just talks to you a lot? Stamper is great. I saw a speedrun of Battle Block Theater that was semi-commentated. Ooh by uh by stamper i guess we did meet him up here didn't we that mirrored cloud looks weird somebody write that down in the chat by the way five seven eight nine two five six four three <laughs> yeah right zounds you again you're decidedly everywhere this must not be coincidental perhaps you're already aware of this but it seems the postal service is overrun by ectoplasm I th for, for a brief moment my brain thought it said it appears the postal service has been overrun by capitalism Maybe the Chief of Spectres is inside there. Yeah. Narrator isn't Hattie, but it is Stamper. Yeah, I know the narrator is Stamper. I just don't know who Hattie Haddington is. I need to play that game, too. Say again. Ah, yes, but the spot is teeming with creatures unbound by nature. Surely a location saturated with Spectres would be the place. I'll be on my way, then. But wait. Are you not confident in your skills? Perhaps you would like to test them in that batting of arm of yours. Go on. That is your call. Would you like to duel this man in fair combat? Hell yeah, I would! Purification in progress. Oh, well, he's not a ducky. Interesting. I, I made the right choice, though. Cunning purr. Oh, we gotta scan him, though. The better! I like that it's pepper steak. Is it just me or is pepper steak way quieter than it usually is? The savior, quote unquote. No weakness resistance. Alpha, the father. Interesting. Um, let's do some honing. Only 400 HP shouldn't be too hard. Ow! Ow! M maybe it will be hard. It hits like a truck. No! I should have expected that from being blinded and all, but jeez. 
Ow. Cunning purr. Oh, that's pretty weak. Run with hatred. Oh, come on, come on. We almost got him. We almost got batter. There we go, okay. Give me that meat, give me that meat, boy. All right, we got him. Not too bad. It's so much more quiet. I, I, pepper steak was kind of loud, normally. It's really like a regular battle theme, but it's really good, so I don't mind too much. So like the, the background ambience is louder. Libra orb received. Oh cool, we get little things. Breaking scler sclerosis has been learned. That's, that is one of the things that he had, wasn't it? Ho ho there, batter. You need a batting arm better than that if you're gonna play for the specters of this land. Bleh. <laughs> Formidable indeed. Nevertheless, we should part ways, Capman Purification. Okay, goodbye, judge. Bleh. Oh! Whoa, did you see that? The, the, pink! He's got pink meat flesh under his mask. Hold it. Wait, oh, you're not Kermit. Hello again, dear Pablo. Zachary, what are you doing? You're a seller of goods, not a driver of plots like yours. Truly! <laughs> Quit calling me Pablo. You know I much prefer the name of the judge. <laughs> Don't be coy cool if you like, companion. I just travel in these parts. Merchant life is rather dull. Besides, when are you going to introduce me to meet your friend? I already know about a tap tap. You all know all about me, too. A fun mutual relationship. My name is Elaine. What do you care? Are you trying to sell me something? <laughs> oh, no. You get the wrong impression, my friend. But but but, but you do you do try to sell us things. Go on already. <laughs> He's a strange one. He's a strange one, Mr. Judge. I must confess, my purpose for coming up here is to help you guide you through this office. Speak up, then, peddler of valuable merchandise. <laughs> Get your asteroid password. Let it be known that the password is right under our noses. Oh! Oh! I think I know. I think I know what this is. Hang on. I think I know what this is. So... Um... There is a zipped file called treasurechest.zip. Oh. But but it wasn't encrypted. Oh! There we go. Now, now it's encrypted. Five... Seven, eight, nine, two. Wait, what? Excuse me? Five, seven, eight, nine, two. Passage typed is not correct. Huh. Never mind. When opening the treasure chest, all letters, no numbers, lowercase only, no spaces. Uh, let me try this. Five, seven, eight, nine, two? No. Uh, th there must be something else then. Okay. It's not the treasure chest.png. Uh, there's not a teeth under my nose. Your advice sucks. <laughs> as much as I'd hate to agree, I can't take make headers of tales of such a hint. Perhaps tap tap seeing something we cannot. I'm sure they've already figured this all out. Well then, it's well within my better judgment. We should test tap tap. The, that's the spirit. If he sees me, there's a giant pond with plastic with my name on it. <laughs> 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 it off. Bye. Keep in mind we're on floor 99,999. Um, well, this was my second guess. Actually, before Zachary said something about password, I figured it was this. Various offices. Stamp. Seven, blah, blah, blah. Stamp. Three, one, one. These are all random. So in the original game, you have to look until they start saying the same thing. I don't think this is the right floor. Huh. I don't know what this, that's a password for, then. Or burnt. Visual exposure. 
I'll pay you an exposure. Ugh, I think we got more snow coming. Places around here got up to a foot. I think we only got like six inches here. Still a lot, of course. We've gotten almost no snow, but when we get snow, it's usually a lot at once. But it was enough that my snow thrower could handle it without too much trouble last time. Um, so this is not a useful floor. Ground floor. Nine. Hmm. Those are all different. We just leave. Snow, you got snow. Oh, you're one of those people that don't get snow. Trust me, snow sucks. You don't want it. The Queen's General owns an office here, but his true house is in Alma. Select. I guess he was like one of the leaders of the Elson. Hi there, what a nice friendly talking cat you are. Oh, oh now we can get to this place that we couldn't get to before. Oh, platinum flesh. Extracting the meat boulders from the cows isn't what I prefer. I do my job well, maybe I'll tra transfer to Alma. It's half a cow. Meat sounds. Did we go to Damien before? Oh yeah, Damien's the second stop. What area do I live in? The United States. You'll see the tramway station names are based on important people of the past. Or someone named the train station after me. Hell yeah, the tap tap train station. Somebody get on that. I'm sure a mayor or something loves my channel. I guess I'm sure in Canada you're... You're molded by the snow. You're one with it. Seven, eight, seven, six, six, six. Well, let's try eight, seven, six, six, six. Eight. Oh, my eyes are all itchy. I need. Hang on. I gotta get some allergy meds. It's Parker's fault. Just a second. What are you doing to me, Parker? Where are you, Parker? Live allergy medication ASMR. I'm just allergic enough that Parker bothers me sometimes. Get a little watery eyed. Ugh. I hate those allergy eye drops, they're like burny. Ugh. Regular Bernie Sanders on your eyes. Ugh. Hopefully that helps. That's part of why I'm probably gonna do a short stream today. Just very allergic to life at the moment. Hello. I thought you jumped off the building. No. No. Looks like you found this building secret room. Right. <laughs> He really shouldn't have Greg's voice. He's just an excuse for me to get Greg in this voice in this game. AKA my Kel voice from Amori. But that was originally from Greg in um, Night in the Woods when I did that game. Oh, what a great game that is, by the way. Highly recommend my playthrough of that. Or just play it yourself, or both. See, I'm always ahead of you. Don't you find that strange? In any case, take this item and go do some more interesting thing. A Taurus orb. Oh, right. I forgot to use the orbs. Gotta use them. May as well make the judge, may as well make her protagonist OP. That's always what you're supposed to do. I always prefer to like make the characters more even, but no. nothing else to say. You have more interesting things to do now. Why are you calling me Pablo, bro? Oh, Night in the Woods is super good. <coughs> Excuse me. 
if you watched Amori, it's, <coughs> excuse me, it's kind of like a non-RPG that only has the real world segments. Water went down the wrong pipe. I hate that. Mio. <clears throat> I thought for a brief moment that would be sixty nine four twenty. No, six nine five four eight. <clears throat> I'm just falling apart in this stream here. <clears throat> Various offices. <clears throat> huh. Love Night in the Woods. Yeah, it's fantastic. I guess it does have some dream moments, but not quite like Amori. Just... <clears throat> Great game, though. I, I love any game that makes me kind of like wax nostalgic about stuff. These numbers. <sighs> I can't seem to find where I'm supposed to go here. <coughs> Anybody got like a slight little hint here? Germ seems to be a lot of fa people's favorite characters. I think they added a bit more to Germ. I, I only played the original version. I haven't yet played the weird autumn update. So the usual trick of just talking to them and find the numbers they repeat has not worked so far. <clears throat> I did put in the numbers on the wall though. So I put it in wrong somehow. Six nine five four eight. That's what I put in last time. Four, eight. I played much of Weird Autumn because Nine was a pretty slow play scan. I couldn't handle too many playthroughs in a row. Yeah, it's been. I haven't played it since launch, so I figured it probably would be about a good time. I kept wanting to stream in Autumn, and then in Autumn, like I'm always busy with Halloween streams. This game like the Shin Megami Tensei Apocalypse of the Off franchise. I I don't know, I've never played SMT actually. I think I got Persona 4G from PlayStation Plus and I played like a couple of minutes of it, honestly. It's hard to get into an RPG sometimes. Yeah, okay. If anybody has a better I like a better idea of what to do, because what I did in off does not seem to be working. Oh, here we go. Ten, two, five, eight. How did I not? I could have swore I talked to that guy. Ten, two, five, eight. Isn't that what it was in the normal game? Oh god damn it! <sighs> Whatever. I'm the judge. I know he's gonna be a burnt. Once you hear that higher pitched one, has a man willing a bat come through here? I I'm I've done nothing wrong. Why are you still yelling at me? Life's rough, buddy. I wouldn't have been able to remember it, but as once I saw it, I guess tomorrow will be better. Hmm? What happened to that poor man? Uh, 
I thought it's like floor whatever and a half. I'm gonna watch a video. It's just Zach laughing for 10 minutes. Ooh! Salvador Dali dogs. What are you? Birk! Four legged ghoul with an uneasy stomach. So are ghouls specters? Are they weak to magic too, or? Oh, whatever. I don't think they are. I think ghouls are monsters, quote unquote. Like burnts and batters and such. You gotta love some nerve fibers. Mm. Oh, that was a that was a solid crit there. I hope off fans find Omori. It's a really good game. Switch it breast. And I have two full playthroughs of it on my channel. There's that boy. Have you ever went fast? We might do a reaction stream of that, um, that Sonic Live fan dub thing they did. I've never seen that. I've, I've, like, seen a couple of very short clips of it. I've seen something about Obama and pissing on the moon, that's about it. But it does seem like it'd be something that'd be fun to do a reaction stream of. It's just I haven't been through this before, but I feel like this is longer than the original Zone 1 was. It was an extra mini-boss, at least. Oh, cube! <laughs> this is the most angelic sound. <laughs> Switch has been pressed. There's that man! Love that man. He really makes me want to play Silent Hill. I almost bought some of the newer Silent Hills. They're like under 20 bucks on Amazon, but I haven't got them yet. Yeah, his Shattered Memories isn't too bad. It seems kind of weird though, like it's a reimagining. It seems to kind of make Harry Mason seem like a jackass. I thought that was kind of weird. Hey, let me in. Uh, I'm sorry, but access to the secret lift is forbidden. D d did I say secret? All right. Well, well, good. That was pass. Really? No, I think that's possible. Let's see how the password. Oh, okay. That's what you meant by the password. Okay. Um, scrolling up. Five, seven, eight, nine, two. Yeah, I thought this was for the thing. Code. It's exactly correct. How? You, you, you must not pass. This version of Zone One's longer. Yeah, seems like it. <clears throat> Bye. I'm going to Alma. It'll be nice. Zoop. Tickle in my throat, I hate it. Yeah, I figure we're probably gonna be doing one <laughs> just one zone per uh per <clears throat> excuse me, per stream. Out of my fucking sight, damn you all the hell. It's my zone. And the master, the leader, the ruler of this land. Now they put a lot of ectoplasmic shit, you worthless prigs. <coughs> you. You. Ever since you gave me the bastard born phantoms have been in full force. Cause all this hard ass work. What do you think you have to say for yourself? Did you bother to show your ugly face in my office? What do you want? <clears throat> my entire existence fuels this place. You got no right to run around with that damn bat of yours. 
Go to hell. Yeah. Yeah. You're mistaken. <coughs> Sorry. Ugh. I brought with me no phantoms, only the tools to eradicate them. I'm a purifier. I came to purge the world, these ectoplastic beings. I gotta get a cough drop. She's got so shitty. I don't know what the deal is. Mm. Barker has been sleeping on me in bed, though. I think I might, like, put the temperature down too cold or something, but he he just <clears throat> won't leave when he sleeps on me. <clears throat> You're the cause of the phantoms. You must be slain. How dare you accuse me of such? I dare you imagine you just put up with this shit. Open your ears, bastard. I'll make this loud and clear. Get out of this zone, ghost. <clears throat> Get gone quicker than the fucking specters you bought into my land. Well, that's clear enough to you. So yeah, this does suggest, again, <clears throat> that the specters were probably sent by the queen to stop the batter, presumably. I believe Dodan points out in the beginning, or in the, the original game, they think the bat, like it's his fault. I see you again. You better just hope I never see you again. I was expecting you to see me in this loo. Were you better? Yeah. I found the chief of specters. Specter? No, no, no. Today is most certainly a flesh and blood. <clears throat> That's some strange phantasm of Goro being. Yeah. He is thorn in the land. He was hostile and pure. He'll be purified. Today is this one's guardian. He'll... There'll be naught but the void left if he perishes. Yeah. It's better that way. Anything is better than this land bleed as it is. That pajama wearing purifiers on inkling of an idea how dead brain this plan is. <clears throat> we can go to Alma. <clears throat> we can't check any of the papers. That was weird. I was sure we'd fight Dedane or something. Note the clock, irrelevant in his uh, theme. Remember that his his clock stopped. <clears throat> it's been nine o'clock for a while. What an ominous statement that is. Did you fight the batter again? I mean, I don't know. This is my first playthrough. The dear fair covered friends, they leisurely stroll on the tramway. I see. It looks like we're heading together, amigos. How'd you survive that fall? That you find your delicious body afloat in the water. I don't like this guy. <laughs> but alas, my friend, this is only a video game. It would be very fun if your friendly merchant died early, would it? Sakura, you're not making s within any reasonable region of sense. It's not my that's not my job, dear judge. My job is to sell you stuff. Anyway, see you in Alma. Okay. Good old Elaine. Why oh, there's Elsons in here? I'm gonna be late to work. I'm a failure. Such a lovely ride. I hope nothing goes wrong. Uh oh. Hello, I'm your train conductor. This train is currently en route for Alma. Please remain seated. Please. Please just sit down on my lap. I'm, I enjoy the company of cats. Certainly not. Uh oh. Uh oh. This is your train conductor speaking. It's easy to run into a group of animals. Please stay calm and stay seated at all times. That's not alarming at all. What is this, Borderlands? So you're trying to get out of speaking, and now Spears monsters are attacking our tram car. In the event that any wake your way inside, please remain calm. Oh, that's good. <laughs> Adversaries have appeared. What are you? A Cantheridae. Flying aquatic ghouls with shark fins. <clears throat> Sharp fins, but also shark fins. It's some kind of extinct fish, isn't it? Mm. 
The Cecil's meat. <laughs> there they go. Mr. Tram Conductor speaking. It's apparent that more monsters are incoming. Cover your eyes and neck and remain calm until the ride is over. Yeah, it's definitely a bit longer than the original one. Possibly more than a bit. <clears throat> Sorry, I'm a bit quiet. My throat's just... Ugh. <coughs> you got that annoying tickle in the back of your throat. So, train conductor speaking, we're now arriving in Alma. Thank you for taking the drone on trainway service. Hey, a consomme professional. They were real consomme professionals. That was a fun ride, if I say so myself. I'll see you around, my furry companions. Oh, is there gonna be puzzles again? Interesting. Those used to be very elaborate, and now they are not. Interesting posters. No, they're not. <laughs> Those are really boring posters. <clears throat> I, uh, I don't have the right to let anyone pass. Let's answer some questions. Numbers on the left side of the post office, first floor, were... Yeah. Entrance to zone one is called Elson. Names of the metro represent the names of important people. One more question. Add up the numbers in the posters. God damn it. It was... 11, 18, and 3, right? That, that's correct. Correct! <clears throat> oh, just these. wrap it up here at the end of zone one for tonight um i'm not sure about streaming tomorrow if i stream tomorrow it'll probably be this or maybe animal crossing I'm, i made my nails are all dirty oh i hate that i haven't had dirty nails since i was a kid i don't know if it's just because like i didn't shower daily as a kid because <laughs> we're talking like young kid here by the way um <clears throat> yeah it took I don't know about you guys, but before puberty, I was more like a weekly bath kind of thing. I get like, plus I would like play outside in dirt and stuff, which is probably a big part of it. But I would get like crap under my nails, and I'd have to like clean it out. Y you, uh... and I've never had that problem since. I just came back. I was doing a cake for dinner. My cakes will burn. That sounds good. Send send cake over TCP/IP, please. I'm here to see the Dan. The Dan. No one's allowed to enter. Uh-oh. I'm doing pretty good other than allergies, question mark, bothering me. First, my eyes were like, you know, a little watery. Now I got that tickle in the back of my throat, and obviously that's kind of a problem when you stream and you don't want to just cough all over. We're going to get fired now. Bye. Same gear. Wait, no, one of these was an upgrade. Oh, oh, no, no, that's magical. I don't, oh, it's expensive, but it's good. I'll buy just one. I guess it makes sense to, like, equip half and half. Virtual cake. It'll, it'll have to do. Oh, yeah, this is where, this is that puzzle in home that was brutal. I think it's been totally changed. I'll get ready for wet meat sounds. This, this padalo is mine. There are many padalos like it, but this one is mine. Did I save that Elson voice in my voice thing folder, by the way? You don't know what I'm talking about. Yeah, I did, good. 
Who's Elaine? Elaine is that weird cat that we found in the mines. I thought it was Valerie. It looks a lot like Valerie's sprite. But no, it's Elaine. He's just a very meat-hungry cat. That's kind of edgy. Huh, those puzzle pieces aren't there. I think his name was, uh, Puzzle Piece or something. He's a cannibal. Yeah, something like that. I think it's more that he just doesn't give any respect to the source of meat, period. I think it's just kind of any kind of meat. Oh, hey! You got 300 credits? I didn't even know there was a thing there. I don't want to move. You can't make me move. Sorry, I, ca I can make you move. With death. <laughs> I love the, 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 the epic sound and then zero. Tractor yawn. <sighs> oh. Tractor yawn. I am slightly disappointed it wasn't a bestiary, though, that, that thing that explains the specters to you. It's neat to get, add more uh, stuff to the gameplay. I always thought it kind of was a shame that the, there's no... Sky Palpits is here. Um, aw, man. There's no um, sane relation to what element is what, so you can't really... Uh, you can't really figure out like what to use on, against what things. Like, it'd be neat if, like, specters were consistently weak to meat, and else, or, like, burnts were weak to metal or something. Puzzles? What puzzles? Too confusing. <laughs> exactly! I wonder if it removed the puzzles because I didn't pick the hardest puzzle difficulty. I forgot someone named Earl was in the chat, and I just thought that was like an adventure time. Yo, Earl! You butt! One million years dungeon! What's happening to me? Alright. Oh, it's one of these boys. Whatever the trick is to these, I never quite learned exactly what it is. They're not too hard to just kind of force about. Wait, do I want them all on or off? No, I want them all off. <clears throat> I'm sure there's a trick to, to these. <clears throat> there we go. Did, did, did that do it? Did, did that do anything? This box is impure! It's a mimic! So I want to touch the snow. Trust me, snow is cool for like five minutes. It's... man. Envy filled treasure chest. Physical attack ignoring defense. Neat. Somehow the image of Judge riding Badala was cursed to me. I mean, you had to get around here somehow, right? Probably not bad damage. Gentle rain. I just know it. Is there no meat sounds? A sound of victory has been found. Nice. Ba -ba 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 -da 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 -da. I know the sound of victory. <clears throat> I don't know about the blood sound, but I know that sound. Let me be. I want to work. Poor Elston's. He's just trying to do his job, and I'm just here murdering him to get access to a badalo. Honestly, I'm the bad guy here. Ha 
Hashtag Elson did nothing wrong. I think my throat's doing a little better. Oh yeah, I swim. When snow, when snow gets rained on, ugh, and driven over, like fresh snow of like one inch, <laughs> it does look a little. Especially the downward sprite of him on the pedalo looks weird. For sweet food or salty food, I like both. Silver flesh has been found. Okay, it, it just didn't tell us the door opened. I kind of figured that would be the case. <laughs> Danger piano is what I call this. What is this effect? Is it like out of tune or like... There's like that echoey effect on... I don't know. You just do it when you want your piano to sound spooky. I've, I've never played enough piano to know what that effect is exactly. Instructions on how to perform the Waltz of the Bloody Moon. Follow these steps to your maintained facing carnal directions will mislead you. Oh, the looping is not quite right. Up, right, right, up. Uh. Hang on. Snipping tool to the rescue. Excuse me. For some reason, the shortcuts, I have a shortcut to open snipping tool and it works like 70% of the time. I, I don't know why. Okay. Up. Right. Right. Up. Left. N Nani. Hang on. Okay, up, right, right, up, left, wait, no, left is this way, damn it. No, oh, wait, go back. It's no flesh maze, Tango. I'll admit. Breaking sclerosis sounds pretty bad. All right, down, forward, right. There we go. That choker's been found. Oh, there's a poster! Even though the poster is far away, I can still read the words printed on it. Before the end, turn around before the last step. Hidden treasure lies here. Oh, god damn it! Why are you gonna do me like that? Okay, fine. I'll bite. Hidden treasure. Left, back, forward, turn back before the last step. So like here? Hey! What's up, batter? A march has been found! Nice. Preventing migraine and instant death. up better. Yeah. I can't seem to find my way through this maze. <laughs> yeah. It'll be fine better. Oh, it's too bad. Yeah. Oh, this is the queen's voice for a second there. Sure you want to pass through this gate? There he is. <laughs> you can feel the thirst for Dedan. 
I never, I never quite understood the thirst people have for the Dan, but there you go. The Queen's Thousand Faces. What in the hell is a bunch of damned cats doing in my office? You've stepped out your boundaries as a guardian. You failed your role. As a, as a result, you must be reprimanded for such actions. You're insane. The guardian is own one. It ain't nothing without me. No one will be damned enough to challenge me. What mental condition do you have, you piss for brains, cat? Listen, metallic guardian of this wicked land. Either work with me, or I'll resort to force. I speak the truth. When I say the land is in danger. You think you're stronger than me? You're not but a fucking fleece-infested sack of fur. You wouldn't dare touch me. I can drag your claws across your face to the point you'll be crying for your precious queen. You don't have time to sit here and argue to Dan. I will forcefully remove you from the zone if I say so myself. Leave the zone at once. You are not safe here. Not safe. No one threatens me. If the queen is my witness. You'll make a fine rug for my floor. Prepare to have your claws ripped out one by one. Ooh, fancy. <laughs> You'll taste the pain, you annoying pussy. I can't even tell if that's supposed to be an insult. Now cut your face to remove that insufferable smile. Your defeat will most likely be the outcome here, Dedan. Tap tap. Let us altercate with this guardian. Everybody has the claw hands. Uh oh. Those nipples. They're, they're, not, they're not female presenting, so it's okay for Tumblr, though. <laughs> we got some metal drums here. and low impact, sure. The <laughs> Tumblr. Oh yeah, let's raise our attack. Snook. Oh, he's got the same attacks, I think. Very frantic music. Sleepy boy! Sleepy boy. <laughs> Although he woke him up with another attack that caused sleep. Oh, he's speaking in Japanese now! Okay. If it's like the normal fight, those don't matter. I believe. He just says that when he takes so many attacks or something. Oops. Well, I attacked it. Crap. You know, Japanese. I know enough to, like, recognize it. I don't know all the kanji or anything. I healed. I hate when bosses do that. Sleeping Elaine is adorable. It is cuter than regular Elaine, I guess. Alright, if he doesn't go down before one of our health goes under 100, I'm gonna start healing. But I got a feeling. Can I borrow a feeling? Alright, it's healing time. Feel <laughs> the speech bubble! I guess it's a good incentive to leave the speech bubble there. Synthetic Symphony is the name of this theme, which is directed in for Dedan's original theme, Fake Orchestra. Ow. Okay. Meat. Oh dang, that's pretty good healing-wise, too.
I always love the name Fake Orchestra. What does that even mean? Furious! Angry. <sighs> Sleeping judges me, IRL. Uh oh, this is kind of bad. Wake up, buddy. Phew! See, Furious is berserk, obviously. Aw, oh, damn it. I was just about to heal you. Attack me, Joker. It's got to be close, right? I guess <laughs> I'll have how the little speech bubble still prevents the ending. Oh, for a brief moment, I thought that was the like the, the theme from Omori when you're around the stump. I was like, what the fuck is going on? But no, cancer guard received judge level seven achieved. <sighs> to Dan, victory is no longer a feasible option for you. Speak up, defeated guardian. Isn't this exactly what we were trying to avoid? Pablo. I'm glad to see you again, my feline friend. What's going on? Why have you left your zone? What? what? Did I knock a few screws loose in that cerebrum of yours? You must depart from the zone in an instant. No option has been presented before me. There's a better judgment. But, but who will watch the workers this land? Who will keep the workers in line? I refuse to leave my zone behind. If you stay here, I cannot reason with you any longer. Hmm. I'll do my best here. You sure this is a good idea? Tap tap, let us depart. Steel Guardian Reserves refuses to move from his outpost. Our best bet is to travel to Zone 2. Maybe we'll have better luck with the Guardian of that zone. Uh oh. Would you like to save? Yep. It's the room. And there's a cat? Question mark? What's up, buddy? He's gone. <clears throat> With a striking force, I felt him fade away from my sight. Edgiest cat ever. And zone one? Hmm. Something appears to me preventing me from visiting this zone. Let's go to zone zero then. No, no smeekrits here. No smeekrits. I, I just figured fake orchestra was just because it sounds like interesting. Honestly. It has interesting and surreal just sounding names. Alright. So, next stream, we're going to do Zone 2. Hopefully, we're going to talk some sense into that Guardian. Probably, probably not. Um, but we'll see. Um, maybe stream possibly as soon as tomorrow, if I feel like streaming tomorrow. Otherwise, next week, um, I probably should take a bit of a break from streaming, though, because I streamed the last three days, including today. Um, I hop in the Discord, we'll probably do a Jackbox game night next Saturday, if we get enough people. I figure if we have a regular game night, we probably shouldn't have enough, we shouldn't probably... Shouldn't have trouble keeping enough people, but um, it's just hard to like schedule all at once, or you know, just with with short notice and all. Um, anyway, 
thanks for watching, everybody. Fun stream. That is home, and we'll definitely be finishing it. So probably one zone per per stream. Seems like they're a couple hours in length, a little bit longer than the off ones. So, good night. Thanks for watching. See you later.